A mod can contain one or more global game modes that can be activated by the host during a multiplayer session. Such game modes can be played on any map, either one created by us or a custom map created by the community. Only one game mode can be active at the same time, but the scene does not need to be restarted when switching game mode. This makes it possible to alter a level with tools or spawn things into it before activating a game mode. To add a game mode to your mod, put a text file called gamemodes.txt in the mod folder and specify which Lua file should be loaded when the mod is activated. The server init and client init functions will be called when the game mode is started, and there are two new callbacks, server destroy and client destroy, that are being called when a game mode is stopped. This gives the script an opportunity to clean up and remove things that were added specifically for that game mode, for instance movable markers, ammo crates, or special vehicles and such. Levels that are built with global game modes in mind have tagged locations to mark appropriate spawn points for players and ammo crates, as well as suggested home base locations for team based game modes. You can find a link to the documentation for all such locations in the description below. When developing new game modes, it's good practice to respect these locations when appropriate. In addition to global game modes, you can also have content game modes. Those are game modes that can only be played on a specific map that comes with a mod. In such cases, we encourage that you put all game mode specific objects and scripts on a separate layer in the editor. Then, instead of providing a script file in gamemodes.txt, you provide the name of that layer. The advantage is that your map can now be used for both your intended game mode and other global game modes. If a global game mode is selected, the map is simply loaded without your special layer. Have a look at content game mode example in our built-in mods for an example mod that showcase this. When developing a global game mode, you can test it by activating it in the mod manager and then launch one of the built-in mod maps. Select the desired number of players and your custom game mode. When working on a game mode, you can leave the test windows open when making changes to the script. To reload and reconnect the clients, simply press F5 or select restart from the pause menu on the host.